Hello, today's topic is one of the most important topics in Revit, which is the copy monitor and coordination review. In Revit, we can copy in three ways. The first way is copy element by copy tool. This is when we want to copy a selected element and place it immediately, for example, in the same view. The second way is copy elements to the clipboard. This is when we need to switch views before placing the copies, for example, to copy an element from one level to another level, or to copy it to another model. The third way is copy monitor. Copy monitor is also used to copy information from one model to another, but copy monitor is primarily used to coordinate efforts between the architectural team and the engineering team working on the same building using the linked models. The procedure of copy monitor. Step one, link files. However, we need to designate the roles of the project team. For the purpose of our demonstration, I will be the BIM coordinator, the engineering team, and the architect. As a BIM coordinator, I have created the host Revit file or model called copy monitor host file. And I am going to link the architectural and structural files. Hit insert tab, link Revit, the architectural file from the architect. Positioning O2, origin to origin. And open. The same will be for the structural file. Step 2. To copy elements from the files which have been already linked to our host file. The linked architectural file. The linked structural file. To copy elements from the linked file, I hit collaborate, copy monitor, select link. I would select that architectural linked file, select on it, copy. I'm going to choose the walls that going to be copied to the host file. For example, I would choose the four walls. So I will click on that control this as well hit finish I would do the same for the structural linked file collaborate copy monitor select link I will select the structural link and copy I will only copy the column in the middle finish all other columns were not copied to my host file. Only that column, which is in the middle, was copied to my host file. The final step is to conduct a coordination review. But what is a coordination review? After we establish relationships between elements using the copy monitor tool, we can perform a coordination review to view and address any warnings generated by changes to those elements. To illustrate that, I have assumed that I am the project architect and I am planning to change the wall layout. But, assumingly, as a BIM coordinator, I need to close out the host file. I am closing out the host file before editing the architectural file. I have changed the wall layout as shown. Then I need to save these changes. Save. Also, I will close out the linked architectural file. I would reopen my host file. Please note the following warning. Instance of link needs coordination review. OK. To respond properly to that warning, we should hit collaborate and coordination review. Select link. 
So this is the deleted element. What is my action? Postponed or reject or delete the element. So I would choose delete the element and apply. Please note the following observation. I will elongate the column which has been copied to my host file, that one, to extend to level 4. Then I should be saving that change and closing out the structural linked file. Please notice what would happen when I am opening my host file. No coordination review is required. This is because that change has no serious impact on the project and it does not contradict with anything. However, I will remove that column, assumingly as if I am the structure engineer. Please note that when I removed the column from the linked structural file, Revit is warning me, an instance of link needs coordination review. The reason of getting that warning is that removing a bearing element such as a column has a serious impact. So I need to hit collaborate, tab, coordination review, select link, I will select that link. We need to highlight on the element that has been deleted so I can respond to the action required. Postpone or reject or delete the element. I am sure that I need to delete that column. The column got deleted. By this, we come to the end of our topic today. Please like this video if you find it helpful.